An FBI whistleblower says top officials were concerned about the Clinton Foundation and about the sale of uranium one, which sold 20 percent of America's uranium reserves to the Russians. Senior investigative reporter Richard Pollack explains from Washington. An FBI whistleblower charges that top level officials in the bureau were privately alarmed about potential criminal activity by Secretary of State Hillary Clinton and the Clinton Foundation over the controversial sale of uranium one to the Russians. In an exclusive broadcast interview, Nate Kane, a former FBI cybersecurity expert, speaks out for the first time about how FBI Director James Comey ignored the wrongdoing by top federal officials. As a protected whistleblower in June 2018, Kane delivered 450 pages of classified documents to Inspector General Michael Horowitz. Since 1996, Kane has been a federal cybersecurity expert. He joined the FBI in 2016. Kane reveals he overheard senior FBI officials expressing private alarm. There was a, a major concern within top brass at the FBI uh, that um, they had come across some very damning information uh, on the Clinton Foundation uh, in regards to Uranium One. He reviewed hundreds of damning documents. These were not um, documents that were open to interpretation. These were uh, evidence documents. Uh, they had already had FBI analyst notes and there were case numbers assigned to it. So when I first came across this information, uh, I sat on it for quite a, a while before I decided to do anything because in all honesty, I thought they're doing something about it. There's case numbers assigned. And, uh, and I thought, you know, they're probably going to indict Hillary Clinton uh, or start indicting people connected with the, uh, the Clinton Foundation soon. The breaking point was when FBI Director Comey declared Hillary Clinton should not be prosecuted. Everything changed the day that, that uh, Director Comey uh, decided to come out in front of the J. Edgar Hoover building and give this press conference where he uh, exonerated Hillary Clinton. Uh, I knew he knew this information that was in the FBI database. I knew that he had likely seen these documents. Uh, if I could get to him, you know, certainly he, he would be able to. Uh, and so the irresponsibility of basically going out there uh, and exonerating her in front of the world, uh, to me, was unconscionable. Because the information he possessed is classified, Kane has never released the documents to the public, and he will not do so unless he receives approval from appropriate federal authorities. For One American News, this is Richard Pollack in Washington.